don't look at me. Estás bien? Sí. Yo soy Diego. Mi, mi esposa Carla. Y este frijolito de aquí es... Um, es Ángel. Oh, Ángela. Encantado. Eh, soy Sean. ¿Cómo te sientes, hijo? Um, ¿Han visto un niño de 10 años? Es mi hermanito. Nos separaron cerca del muro. Está herido. Lo llevaron a la enfermería. Si fuera grave, una ambulancia ya habría venido a buscarlo. Si lo dejaron aquí, quiere decir que está bien. Tranquilo, amigo. Aquí no hacen daño a los niños. I hope that Campbell's almost done with the paperwork. Then we're out and we're not coming This back. guy must be trained not to listen to anything you say. fucking gross. Seriously. Why are you doing this? What's your problem? Doing what? You shot my ten-year-old brother. It was a mistake. It's just a graze. The fall is what knocked him out. Oh, you don't have to talk to him. Dad. Is Daryl watching the kids? Uh, no. Nah. He worked a double shift today. His sister's got him. Good. She's a good kid. And she's more patient than your husband. <sighs> so tired of all this shit. <sighs> no way I can break through that door without Daniel's help. What the hell is wrong with these people? I wonder how long they've been here, and why. <sighs> Thanks. I'll remember that. Excuse me. Do you know where my brother is? He's just a kid. Hello? Hello? Ah, uh, got it. Okay. Thank you. Pendejo. Saben cuánto tiempo ¿Nos van a dejar aquí? No. Esta es la primera vez que intento cruzar. Me acuerdo de nuestra primera vez. Casi morimos de sed en el desierto. No somos ilegales. Nacimos aquí. Intentamos... llegar... a México. Pues, ustedes van a ser ilegales en México. Cuestión de perspectiva. Es la tercera vez que intentamos cruzar la frontera. ¿Por qué necesitan cruzar tan desesperadamente? Por las mismas razones que todos. No podemos soportar la inseguridad ni la miseria. En México, la violencia tiene muchas formas. No se puede vivir así. Cuando mi hermano fue secuestrado y, y asesinado por una pandilla, nos fuimos. Si hubiésemos podido quedarnos, nos habríamos quedado en nuestro pueblo, pero queremos darle una vida, una vida mejor a nuestro hijo o hija. Es lo que hizo mi papá. Se fue de México cuando murieron sus padres para ganarse la vida. Pero yo sé que extrañaba su pueblo natal. Por supuesto, pero seguro que tuvo sus razones para irse, como nosotros. No quiero desanimarte, amigo, pero lo de México no va a ser fácil para ustedes. 
Es un país magnífico. Y me cuesta muchísimo dejarlo, pero... Allá va a ser muy complicado cumplir tus sueños. Ya no tengo sueños aquí. Sean, has vivido en este país toda tu vida con un padre mexicano. Y ahora los tiempos han cambiado. ¿Cómo crees que va a ser todo en el futuro? Los tiempos cambian. Pero la gente también. En el camino... Encontré muchos aliados. Ojalá haya menos personas intolerantes en el futuro. Ojalá. Cuando eres extranjero, tienes que trabajar aún más duro para arreglártelas. Así funciona. Oh, shit. Enough now. It's America. We speak English. We're just talking. No, the problem is you people breaking into my country. We come here to work, not, not steal. Or live at your, at your home? Diego, no, I am so fucking tired. You only come here to cause trouble. And we have to pay for your welfare. You all want a free ride. And that makes me sick. Immigrants built this country. Where did the founding fathers come from, huh? No, 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 that was different. They made the laws. They wouldn't stand by and let this happen. We only want work and, and, and in peace. Yes. An honest job and the ability to raise our child in a safe country. That's all we're looking for. <laughs> That's what you people always say. But the facts speak for themselves. My dad was an immigrant and he worked his ass off. Raised a family and made a business. Yeah, and his son ended up in jail. What a role model. Thanks for proving my point. Damn right, baby girl. You hunt us like, 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 like animals. I don't think I have a choice. I want the safest country for my children. See, you love your family like us. We don't go walking hundreds of miles in the desert and risking everything for no reason. We do it for our child. A mother must understand. No, you and your unborn parasite have nothing in common with me and my family. <laughs> what? Maddie. What'd you say? <laughs> oh, see? There you go. Take it easy. This is our country. You win. I would like to get out of here soon. No, you no va a ganar. Dile esto, Carla. Ya, basta. No vale mi Fuck you, you wetback. You and your what girlfriend. What the fuck? Yo! Madison, everybody calm down. <sighs> Campbell, tell me we're out of here. Why are we stuck down here with them? You know us. We're helping you, goddammit. Hey, you have the right to remain silent, so fucking use it, okay? <sighs> All right. Diaz, you're up. How's my brother? Don't worry about him. Now turn around. Hands behind your back. And no more fighting down here. Or I'm gonna get mean. Okay? Let's move it. All right. Sit down. Where's my brother? He's doing fine for a kid who got grazed by a bullet. Lost some blood. But he's tough. They're taking care of him at the infirmary. You want coffee? Okay. Good. Be right back. Fuck. What did they do with Daniel? I hope he's up. Great. Now I can put on a fucking show. Oh shit. Is it morning already? I haven't seen Daniel since yesterday. No point in getting these off. There are cops everywhere. Of course not. How am I gonna get myself out of this mess? Great. 
Now I can put on a fucking show. How am I gonna get myself out of this mess? There you go. Looks like you need it. Thanks. All right. Let's see. Hmm. Okay. Damn. Seriously? Yeah. No. Coffee's gonna make me feel so much better. At least it'll keep me up. <sighs> Jeez. That's quite a crime spree. It's hard to believe what kids can do nowadays. Killing that officer in Seattle. Vandalizing a motel room. Caught in a, another weird explosion at a pot farm in California. Then, you join a religious commune in Nevada, and its leader is found dead short after. Hmm. And we're not even halfway down the list. One of those things you could get away with. But not all that. It sounds crazy, but I can explain. Explain it to Agent Flores. She's on her way now. She spoke to your mother, who took responsibility for the church fire. She says a lot. Who cares? You don't have any proof. But sure, throw another innocent in jail. I don't really care. <laughs> I bet she'd be happy to hear that. Listen, I feel sorry for you. I really do. But. Denying what you did will only make things worse. It wasn't my fault. All I did was try to survive. Yeah, I guess you did. You know, I read the report. You claim that Officer Matthew's death was an accident. So why didn't you wait for the police? I panicked, okay? Then it was too late. We were already criminals. Well, it's no reason to make things worse by running away, kid. Good news is, your brother's too young to be prosecuted. He'll end up with your grandparents, if they want him. But you're facing a shitload of years between bars. At least he'll get a life. Uh, what I don't get is how two kids can destroy so much stuff. I mean, anywhere you went, something blew up. Seriously. How? Those were just random accidents. Yeah, it's crazy, but it just happens around us. I can't explain it. Uh-huh. Listen, once is an accident. Twice is luck. Three times is enemy action. Whoa! Uh, what is that? Sir? I don't think you should... Keep your ass in that seat. How do you feel? I, I'm okay. Just a little headache. Hold on. Dude, we gotta go. Hold up. 
Is he okay? I I wanted to rescue you, but I I had to use my power. I didn't want to hurt him. He's okay. Don't worry. Shall we try to make peace with these morons? We'll help Carla and Diego. They came all the way from Mexico and got thrown in jail for it. As for the others, they're the ones who tried to shoot you. What? They got locked up? Good. Oh, go to hell. Wait. Aren't you supposed to be in a hospital? You look like... Hold on. We're gonna get you out. Daniel? Wow. That's it! Gracias. Muchas gracias. It's better me aquí. Until I check this out. Oh, of course. Oh, holy mother! How'd you do that? How? Wait, what the fuck are you? Okay, hands oh, up! Shit! Don't hands move. up! Shoot! Hands up! Do not move! Wait! Sean! Stay back, Daniel. Let me think. Sean, what do I do? Quick! I gotta find something to stop them. The muck, dude! Stop Oh, it's dangerous! Be careful! The chair! What the fuck? I'm scared. Okay, do what something. the fuck? Do not move! Don't we do will anything see stupid! Me. Throw that locker. I... didn't want to hurt anybody anymore. You saved us. You had no choice. Now... Let's bail. Sean, I think our things are in there. Hey, hey, hey! Step, what did you do? You fucking fucker! Nice. Don't move. I'll be right back. Uh, okay, but be quick. They must really feel threatened to put so much effort into this. Come on, Sean! We gotta go! We would be so dead if we didn't have Daniel's power. Take it out, Daniel. Que Dios los bendiga. Okay, go! Go! Let's roll, Daniel. Chasing us. Not yet. Emergency. This is an all points bulletin for every unit in the area. Multiple prisoners, two adults, and two teenagers have escaped from the El Ray police station. They are considered armed and dangerous. Repeat. Are we still going to Mexico? Yeah. We got nowhere else to go. Sean, it's the 4th of July. Our first one without dad. You're right. Remember 
how he was so in the fireworks every year. He always made us go too early so we could get a good spot. <laughs> I know. He was so corny. He said he was proud to live in this country. Sean, what are we going to do? Sean! Sean Diaz! It's over! Don't make this worse! Get out of the car! Slow! Wave your head above your head! Do exactly what I say! You know that day in Seattle, the day Dad was shot, I think about it every day, and I would give anything to change what happened, but I can't. I'm sorry for my mistakes. I tried my best. I swear. Sean. I'm so proud of you, Nano. Just like Dad would be. We both learned a lot together. But you can make your own rules now. If we surrender, they will separate us, Daniel. And if that happens, promise me that you will always do the right thing, okay? Don't. Waste your power. Be smart like you already are. I don't want to be separated. Please. Don't make any more mistakes. Whatever happens, always remember that you're Daniel Diaz. I promise, Sean. So, how does the story of the Wolf Brothers end?